Still working, right? Can you go to Twitch on my phone? And search for my name or I don't know. See if you can figure out if my video is working right. Turn the volume down though. Where is Twitch at? Entertainment. Yeah. So welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. We are on our quest to kill the eternal bosses. I think I might. I want to start as Judas again. I like starting with Book of Belial. I'm going to go ahead and start and get my cursor off the screen there. All right, I like starting with Book of Belial. It's going to give me some guaranteed damage. I'd love to go into that curse room. Not sure if that's going to be a possibility. We'll see. I uh, should probably shoot the poop. There's no such thing as boss rush in vanilla, so really no repercussions for spending as much time as you want on a floor. That heart could maybe come in handy. Not incredibly likely, though. All right, we got our boss fight there. No, oh, I was going to say no eternal enemies yet, but there is uh, an eternal pooter, I think. I believe that's the name of that enemy for reals, for realsies. I do have the, uh, the eternal mode on. Just checked to make sure hard mode is indeed on. All right. Killed all the other riffraff. I've kind of learned that I think that's a good approach to the eternal enemies is to clear everything else out first. Oh, sorry if you hear my own voice in the background there. My girlfriend just checking my stream for me. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got sack of pennies. Not exactly an ideal first pickup for a strong run, but it's hashtag it's something. All right, Pooter, lol. Hey, Sacred Leo, welcome. Coming here from my uh, YouTube channel. Did you somehow see that I'm live? That's awesome. All right, or actually, I think you might have subscribed or uh, followed me here as well. I should remember to use Book of Belial here. Absolutely. This is an eternal Larry Jr., I think. Can't really be sure, to be honest. I think it is, though. He looks white-ish, right? Yep, he creates creep. Yep. This is bad. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Kill one of the bits. Kill one of the bits. There we go. Oh, don't come down here, okay? Stay safe. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Oh, don't. You regenerate too? You monster. Alright. We got an eternal heart. I can't go into the curse room, but I can if I pick this up. Yeah, that's that's the way you do it. That's the way you debate. Here we go. How you doing, Sacred Leo? Oh, that was worth it. Alright. Well, we got a full heart down here. We can get back up to health here and take the eternal heart with us for an HP up. Oh, that one. All right, there is a an achievement in the Eternal Edition where if you get uh, seven eternal heart, seven HP from eternal hearts, you become eternal. I think, which gives you the ability to fly and a damage up. If I read correctly I haven't done it yet and it is an achievement for the uh, expansion here so definitely be looking to make that happen if at all possible we'll, we'll give it a shot feeling okay I'm um, not feeling great about either of our first items really I mean the HP is nice I guess as Judas but um, I could really use a soul heart or just any kind of damage the fact that we just got sack of pennies in the first item room pretty much subpar uh, not what you're looking for really I mean it might enable me to get one extra shop item if I live that long but uh, not really all that helpful I don't even know why I really triggered you I don't think I can get anything extra from that fly oh, almost took some real bad damage there we got a key right on time let's go in here lard it's gonna make me slower I'll pick it up. I'll pick it up. I was tempted to wait until after the boss fight actually to pick it up, but I'll go fight now. It's not Eternal Monstro. Thank goodness. Eternal Monstro is kind of a pain in the dick. Alright. Let's get this done. 
Should not take any damage in this fight, although it's been a while since I've fought Monstro in vanilla. Fight him all the time in friggin' Rebirth, but it's been a while since I've played vanilla. Could get caught off guard by one of his weird arching shots, you never know. It's looking good. Nailed it. Alright. So we take, we go in the deal with the devil first. But we'll do this first. We'll go ahead and... Actually, you know what? Let's not take the pills, because if we, we could get down to 1 HP, conceive blue of the deal with the devil, and then a uh, health down would turn into a health up. I am greedy, so I'm going to take both of these. Am I going to take both of these? I definitely wanted flight. Luckfoot? I don't know, man. Let's take it. I'm greedy. What, what can I say? Tears up. Telepills. So I can't get something from both of these. Might as well pick this one up now and then just go pick up the other one. Like, we only need one to get the eternal heart HP up. So I'll pick up these two right away here and then maybe there's some off chance that I'll get a third on this floor. That would be a little crazy. I don't know if I've ever gotten a three eternal hearts on one floor, but then again, I've never played the Eternal Edition, so bombs are key. Alright, that was actually a pretty good set of pills. Um, no bombs now, since we did the bombs are key, though. Um, go in while we have full health. I can go in here. Hmm. <laughs> I think we saved the key. This is a free chest, though. Let's do this one. Uh, I mean, I might rather have the key, but that's a lot of money. I can check for a secret room. There's two locations. Let's check here. Let's get just real greedy. Hey -oh! Oh. <laughs> A bomb right away. Uh, that would have been ideal. Uh, let's go. Save the 15 cents and get out of here. Could go do some funky stuff with the arcade. I'm not gonna. I like having 15 cents. We can get something from the shop on the next floor. I'm glad to see you too, Sacred Leo. I saw that a little earlier. I just didn't respond because I was lost in my own Isaac thought, but glad to hear you're waiting to see me stream. That's very flattering, very nice of you to say. Alright, so that guy was just kind of following me in a weird little circle. Very easy to fight. Oh, I can fly! Haha, -ha, the creep. That's actually really... Oh, I thought that was Judas's tongue. That's child heart. That's not as good. Um, I can fly. Creep holds no, no danger for me. Eternal fly, however, could be problematic on this room. Eternal fly is... It's one of those enemies that just catches you unaware right like you always you underestimate the eternal fly like he'll just keep circling and then you'll run into him he won't do anything out of the ordinary definitely an easy enemy to underestimate i like you being there oh come on this is sack of shit run sack of everything run bomb bag and sack of pennies this does not really look like a, a stellar run here Mm, might as well give you two cents, why not? Or one cent, and you'll give me Monster Manuel. <laughs> These items, man. Oh, It's funny, because I, uh, I was doing a, a test, just... Oh, I took some damage. I should have maybe clammed up, because this is an eternal enemy. Oh, my goodness. Get off me, dog. Quit stealing all my monies. Um, I recorded... A test recording just to check my levels and the first three things I got were guppy's paw small rock and I think an extra soul heart all like in quick succession on my recording that didn't matter uh, this game sometimes RNG is mean right. can just kind of hang out over the gap here Tears up. Happy to have it. Not getting shit for our items. At least our pills have been kind to us. Got a good rate of fire now. 
Just would love some damage to go along with it. We've already taken red heart damage, so screw it. Let's go in here. I'll even, uh, yeah, I'll do it. We'll lose, like, a couple hearts here. Nope. Well, one full heart. Back up to two and a half, though. Let's just go fight for now. Blighted Ovum. It's a regular Blighted Ovum. Happy to see that. We're getting nice rolls on our bosses not being eternal options, which is pretty nice. And... Soul Heart, and actually some damage. I believe Jesus Juice is actual damage, even though it just says range and tears in this game. Them Eternal Flies are definitely the reason for some lost fails, in my experience as well. Uh, Eternal Flies, regular flies, <laughs> spiders, jumping spiders, Ipecac shooters, leapers, hoppers, Every boss, you know. <laughs> Playing as the loss sucks. How about that? Let's just, let's just leave it at that. But, uh... Oh, wow. Actually got a nice little uh, soul heart bank going here. Uh, 20 cents. We should definitely investigate the shop. I will take mom's purse. It's just going to give us more trinket room. But we could get like curved horn or a couple really nice trinkets. Child's heart's fine. Um, it's it's an investment. It's not the craziest, you know, kind of like high reward investment. But it might turn out well for us. Mm hmm. All right. Down to the next floor with three and three. Health bank, if we can't stack up damage, might as well stack up HP. Alright. Free eight cents, I like that. Thank you, Lord of the Pit, for giving me the ability to fly. Yeah, I was gonna say, if you wanna go ahead and open up a secret or second secret room, feel free. Nobody shoot me down here too, no? Oh, come on, that wasn't that wasn't gonna do it. Oh, I got hit because I'm an idiot. I'm oh, just checking. Well, thankfully, that was uh, contact damage and not a bomb damage, so it was half a heart and not a full heart. That won't stay open. Okay, I was worried it actually. I was actually kind of worried it would be an eternal heart. I don't really care about that. In vanilla, the uh, bombed secret rooms do not stay open, unfortunately. Which always kind of made little sense to me. But it's the way it is, and uh, Florian, the developer of this update, decided not to change it in the update, which is his prerogative. Well, we have two and a half soul heart buffer. Let's fight. Deal with devil chance. It's important. Regular pestilence. Again, good boss fight roll. Should be able to kind of play chicken with these guys a little bit. Because we have uh, good tier rate and good damage from Book of Belial. Did get the Jesus Juice um, upgrade as well. But mostly it's Book of Belial. Just still from the beginning. Jesus Juice not a huge damage up. And no deal. Cube meat is nice to have, though. I do occasionally. Do I think I'll keep the Eternal Update stream only? Um, I've been thinking I would just do it on stream because uh, I just don't think I'll put that much time in it to really warrant like a full um, series, let's play series. But I don't know. I, I could maybe do some regular videos too. If you're asking if the stream itself is going to include other games, um, definitely going to be streaming more over the summer and including um, regular Rebirth. Um, maybe I was thinking about adding in maybe like Nuclear Throne or something, oh, trying to get into streaming a little more. Wow, this is uh, a little nuts. little bad, a little bad right here. Glad I went and fought the boss first because we're in danger of losing our soul hearts altogether. Should have maybe moved to the left side of the room immediately with this uh, this white guy over here. He shoots, shoots way too many bombs. Can't open that. I like the little intro music for the boss trap room. I didn't... Um, I never really realized that's missing from uh, Rebirth. There is no like little jingle when you enter the room to like kind of pump you up. It's not something that I probably would have noticed at all if I didn't come in here and play the regular version and 
notice the difference, the contrast. <clears throat> hmm. All right, that room went a lot more smoothly. We already found our second secret room. We didn't find the regular one yet. All right, these guys suck. I'm actually gonna use, I haven't been using Book of Belial enough. I'm gonna use it here because these guys can sometimes be a little tricky to kill without taking damage. Perfect. Um, maybe I will use a bomb here to check for our secret room. Perfect. Unicorn horn is not what I want. Pick it up, put it back down, get out of here. Just tried to hit the map button again. I do that a lot when playing uh, vanilla because there is a map button in Rebirth and there's not in the regular game. So just got to look at it. It's already there. Don't have to bring it up. No keys. Cool. Okay, that that spider is actually not that hard to kill, I don't think, but it, it definitely gets credit for one of the freakier additions to the game. The thing is freaky as heck. Yeah, but he's not that scary as long as you don't, you know, explode him with a ton of en other enemies also in the room. I'll do it. Soul hearts, Guppy's head. Hmm. Guppy's head is good. Got to stick. Well. Do I need to stick with the book? I think I need to stick with the book. It's tempting though. I like having the consistency of the flies. Flies come with you to every room, whereas Book of Belial, only every three rooms, but Book of Belial is more damage. And you can choose kind of when to use it. You might run out, oh, I really shouldn't have stayed in there. You might run out of flies, and then you like you can't be like, oh, Guppy's head, can you make me some more flies? I'll be like, no, I, I just did. That's all I got. Uh... Come on, I just want the penny here. Just knock it off. Did it look like sack of pennies killed that fly? I don't, I'm pretty sure that's not what happened, but it, I think it was a cube of meat. Yeah, it was a cube of meat. Um. I can't get into either of those rooms. That sucks. And that's a golden chest down in the trap room. Yep. Um, was this a regular slot machine? It was a fortune teller, but I'm still going to go blow it up because I've got five bombs. I think there's a chance it could give me a key. Also give me soul heart, so I'll play a few cents into it. <laughs> that's what I was going to do anyway, so. Fine, game. We'll just do it earlier than I wanted to. Uh, I lost a lot of soul heart health on this level, which I'm not happy about. But I don't really see this run going very far regardless of how much HP I have at this point, because I'm not very strong. We do have one guppy item, but that's not a huge get so far. Um, and our item rooms have been total garbage, even though, well, we couldn't check the last item room, which... You don't, I don't, you don't need me to tell you that's bad. Um... Yeah, we'll see if we can turn this into something, but it's going to require both skill and luck. And most of the time, I possess neither. Alright. Okay, we can be careful here. Good stuff. If I can find the boss room right away, I'm not opposed to just fighting it right away. Oh, man. Keep moving, keep moving, okay, keep moving, good deal, haha. <laughs> oh, I got distracted looking to see if there were eternal enemies in here and I just took some stupid damage. I am going to pop this though because this might just take a while to clear out this room otherwise. These guys do a full heart, which is important to know. All of them do a full heart, not just the champions of damage with their chub shots. I don't know what was the difference with the Eternal guy there. He didn't seem that much stronger than the regular champion. And that's different, because typically the Eternal guys are much, much stronger. Cool. Uh, oh. Don't play chicken with the the big white head. That sounds really... That's a really weird phrasing choice. 
Oh my gosh. Okay. Just settle. Yeah, I should not be taking this much damage. Their movement is predictable. I can fly. Tears up. I appreciate it. I think we're we're nearing max tier rate here. One heart. One red heart left. Oh, I should have backtracked and got those other hearts probably, huh? Probably should have backtracked and got those other hearts if I had to say. Alright. Oh, you shoot cr you produce creep. Well, you're it wasn't you in the other room anyway, but it's good to know about that one. Just in case in the future when I cannot fly. It's important to note. Secret room, maybe? Not our secret room. I'll go get the HP. So I don't die for at least a little longer. Do you think you'll be getting the Afterbirth update close to launch? Yeah, I'll be getting the Afterbirth update the day it comes out. Guaranteed. Okay, let's see if we can't. Whoop! Whoop! Yeah! Nailed it! Um, I do want to go to the shop. Thank you. Little, uh, fairy on my shoulder. I don't want to go to the shop. <laughs> fairy on my shoulder. You are the absolute worst. Um, no, this is fine. It's fine. We already took red heart damage. Don't worry. I'm just going to die on this room. No, it's fine. We're, we'll be fine. I fought greed a lot. I shouldn't have gotten hit twice. Should have been able to just get this money for free. So we traded a key for a whole shitload of money and a bomb. Not so bad. And we traded one HP. Let's not let's not leave that out of the equation. It's an important factor. Oh, the the lar the large size of the eternal enemies does always kind of get me. Like, look at that behemoth. And does it not take damage from the explosion? If you ask me, that part is BS. All the other enemies take damage. Take damage from the explosion. I don't know why you don't. Oh my goodness! Get off me. I think it did there, actually. I guess it just wasn't, like, flickering like it was taking damage from the explosion. Okay. But yeah, I'll be getting the Afterbirth update I immediately, I, I believe. Whenever I can, basically. Nice. Got them in a little cluster there. Uh, let's keep checking for our secret room. It could be below this room over here. Seems likely. It indeed is there. We got a lot of money. I should definitely play this for many reasons. That being chief among them, I think, actually, the pretty fly. HP is a close second, though. Orbitals actually more important. To getting a full suite of orbitals, generally speaking, more important to me than HP. Um, helps out a ton in you not taking damage. Like, one orbital, I think, saves you more damage or is worth more than the equivalent of one heart. Definitely. Unless, you know, the, the like caveat to that would be if you have like half a heart, then HP is pretty important. You know, just to make sure you don't immediately die. Oh, come on. Give me that pretty fly. Sucker. Uh, more HP. Do I need... Uh, I could go for another pretty fly I might just blow this up because I'm getting tired of it let's go down to 24 cents if we get to 24 cents we'll put a bomb down all right game keeping me in limbo <laughs> just put out pennies if you do it like 10 times in a row I will laugh my ass off all right oh and a pill I don't think we know this one. Oh, we do bombs are key I'm gonna keep it I'm not gonna use it yet because I could need the bombs eventually. Um, I wish I could go back in time and use it when I skip that item room, but it's not a thing. Um, so, I'm not going to consult you or blow you up yet. There's some health in the secret room. I'll think about what I'm going to do there. Some health in the secret room. I do want to play him at least a little bit, so we'll fight the boss and then probably revisit that whole shenanigan a little later once we know our HP situation for sure. Don't want to do it before the boss. That's just too risky and silly. If I end up getting an eternal boss and dying, I'll regret that, but I'm not going to, you know, operate on that not very likely scenario. This is bad. Again, 
Space Brightum, we don't want to replace uh, Book of Belial with the Game Kid. It's a bad pickup. Oh, this is kind of bad, too. Oh, yep. Took some damage. Just getting freaked out by the big whitey. Okay. Stay over here. I think maybe he won't aggro toward us. And then... Now we hatch our master plan for him to hatch into a bazillion spiders. There they go. There it splooges. Juicy. Juicy spiders everywhere. Alright, so. I think we save that. Go in here. Mask of Infamy. It's not Eternal Mask of Infamy, right? Alright. Good deal. I don't like Mask of Infamy, but our tier rate and shot speed are decent. I think we should be able to handle this fight. Alright. I've had fights with Mask of Infamy that will last for that have lasted for freaking ever. I don't think this is gonna be one of them. It still will be annoying, and there's some damage from it, but best thing to do to kind of track sideways with him. There we go. There we go. That's the way you do it. Oh. And stay far away, because he'll do some crazy turns sometimes. Like that. <laughs> Thank you for proving my point, Mask of Infamy. I'm glad you stuck to what we rehearsed in the, the dress rehearsal. It allowed me to prove my point very effectively. And the check is in the mail. Okay. Alright. That could have gone better, I'm not going to lie. We need uh, deals. We're not getting any. So, let's go... Play this guy. Yep, these guys are paying out fast. I don't want to use friggin' teleport though. I'll leave teleport there. If there's a curse room, maybe I'll take teleport in and just use it to avoid the health on the way out, but or the health loss on the way out. There's not. A, oh my gosh, that thing shot me just like right in the face. <sighs> All right, okay, getting sloppy. Getting sloppy. Should I open this? Yes, because I have bombs or key. Okay, that's going to open that. Which has a regular chest in it. We've got a library down here. Go shadows. Telepathy for dummies. Just pick them up. We're going to go up here. I am going to do this. I may regret this. These enemies are not super easy. But despite all appearances, I think I'm playing alright. I think I'm getting a little lazy when I'm talking. Taking a little bit extra damage, but I think I can lock it down. And that's why I felt confident enough to tackle these enemies. Got lucky to not get too many eternal options in here. And pretty easy fight. Oh, I thought we were done. <laughs> we are not done. Did that change? Were there four waves? Is that four waves? I don't know if I counted right there. Oh. Okay. You. You're the fast version. There we go. Pill. We don't know this one. Range up. All right. That's fine. Keep bombs or keys still. Probably end up using it soon. Should, uh, should look maybe for the second secret room while we have the bombs there are a lot of options let's check it like often is near the boss let's try here I actually I don't know if that's true in regular Isaac it's true in vanilla er, uh, I don't know if it's true in vanilla it's true in rebirth um Man, this is going to use a lot of bombs. I'm not going to do it. It's too many options. There's like... One, two, three, four... A lot. <laughs> There's like at least like seven options I can see from right now. Uh, for a second secret room. So we're just going to move along to the next floor. Not feeling great about my chances, to be honest. Five HP. Uh, not a lot of damage. 
Well, let's use bombs or key now, because I want to go in the shop. Compass is good. Uh, we'll buy the compass. We'll actually buy the bomb. And I'll buy the soul heart, too. Fuck it. Um, there's a mob trap room and an arcade that way. I'm not entirely interested in heading in that direction. But I could be persuaded. <laughs> Look at that Look at this one guts showing off, just lapping the other one. What a jerk. <laughs> and they both died on the spike. That's awesome. Horror of Babylon. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. It doesn't do anything for us after we leave this room. Need to lose HP. I may go to the arcade and lose HP on purpose. Let's fight you. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh god, I was thinking, oh, let's fight a mini-boss. We can get a cool item from a mini-boss. Don't fight the mini-boss, kids. Stay in school. Oh, holy crap. You shoot, too. Like, in circles. What an asshole. Do you not shoot after we get you out of your first form? I think that might be true. Okay, I like that. Wow, did you get nerfed like crazy? I met, remember this fight being a lot harder. I think this might have been nerfed. This fight took me, like, a thousand years in my last... Like, not a thousand, but, like, give or take a hundred years. It took me a thousand years. <sighs> mm-hmm. I want to lose health now. I want to... Oh, hey, hello. <laughs> Your wish is my command. Oh, wait. Can we use Maggie's faith, or whatever that is called, to, uh... Yeah, there's the whore Babylon. Hmm. Friends till the end. Um, can we use Maggie's faith to get that eternal heart madness that we want? That achievement? Alright, I got Horror Babylon. That's what I wanted. So now I don't have to go over there. Got an eternal heart in there that I want to come back for. But we're on depths too, so I can't leave the mob fight. So I got to take it now. That sucks. Well, I don't have to take it right now, but I'm gonna... I could have waited a little bit. This is our last shop, so I might as well play you as well. Oh, now I regret taking that Eternal Heart big time. Didn't didn't really think that through. Did not really think that through. Oh. Oh. Didn't really think that through, because now I can't go. I could have used that health on the Demon Beggar, and now I can't. Thank you, flies. Come on now. Okay, that was scary. Lots of scary dodges. Some of the enemy shooting patterns seem a lot actually harder than rebirth. Oh, like that. That was bad. You're a little too bound. You're a little way bouncier than you are in rebirth. You enemies, you slide around. It messes with my dodge foo. Red Heart, another library. Are we close to exhausting the books? We, I guess we did, but I would think that would give me another item in here, you jerks. All right, let's fight. Uh, let's fight. Let's look for a secret room first. Check one more spot. I'm not traipsing all over the floor. Check one more spot. I'm not traipsing all over the floor, though. Check here. All right. Where are you? Bombs are key. Do I need the bombs more now? Maybe? I don't know. We could increase our... Uh... This is a trick. Let's increase our devil deal chance. This is like going to guarantee us to deal with the devil if I blow these. Not guarantee, but I think each one raises it by like 20 or 30% each beggar you blow up. Die, sucker. And he gave me a tears up. Win, win. You got to be like almost. I think this might be max now. All right. Don't forget to use that. All right, this is eternal mom. Which is totally annoying. Thank you for killing your own enemies, though. I do appreciate that so much. It's not going bad so far. 
It's a big foot shadow. Thank you so much. You are the best foot I have ever met. I love the little angry boss face. I miss that. A little angry boss face on the health bar. Oh! Alright. I would love if this was an eternal heart, too. Nope, it's not. It's okay. And soul hearts. Need the Polaroid. I want Maggie's Faith, though, for the red health ups. Rather than uh, Child's Heart. World card is nice to have. I could take Liberty Cap, but actually I'd rather have Polaroid Maggie's Faith. So we're going to roll that way. Take the range up. Take the world with us. And we'll go. Alright. Maggie's Faith gave us another Eternal Heart. We got a Curse Room all the way to the right there. I got one Guppy item. Is it worth it to go all the way over there, though? Who dares wins? Let's do it. I'll play you. I don't have any other need for money, I don't think, really. I have no need for earthly possessions. I have reached a zen state. Can't really tell what our... Uh... Hello, doppelganger. Can't really tell what our... Uh... Oh! Ah. Our tinted rocks. Finally got that sentence out of my brain pan. Can't really tell what our tinted rocks in this game like you can in rebirth on the womb don't think it's very easy to tell judgment die judgment die another tears up oh my goodness happy birthday to me oh how did i not get hit there i don't know is the answer i should have <laughs> Definitely gotten hit there. Guppy! Oh, you suck. Oh, I can't shoot troll bombs away from me. That's right. I haven't used the world card yet. I'm gonna use the world card on the cathedral if I can make it there. Alright, die, judgment, die. Tears up. <laughs> Never fails. Kill a judgment, get a tears up. Okay, let's use this here. Oh, slow down. Game slow down. <laughs> you can handle it, game. The Book of Belial, the Eternal Enemy, the the Womb, the Tears. Oh, stop with the producing enemies. That's not cool. No one... You were invited to the party, but not your freaking little brothers. Now I gotta watch them all night and make sure they don't drink from the solo cups that people leave laying out, you asshole. You've made a lot of work for everyone here, and no one can enjoy themselves. Oh, come on. Stop! Stop it! It's freaking whack-a-mole. How many times am I going to see this same spider? A lot, apparently. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. Eternal heart in jeopardy. Okay. Lock it up. You lock it up. That's got to be our secret room with greed in it there, I think, because it doesn't have a door. I mean, this greed is in our secret room. Kill the doppel with the meat cube. Got Book of Belial ready pretty much on time here. Oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> no! <laughs> Eternal heart, I hardly knew ye! Ugh. Painful. Painful. Let's check for a second secret. Just hoping to get lucky there. Oh, another doppel. Easy with my cube. Thank you, C-O-M. And we got the regular double... Oh, it's an XL floor, though. Um, so I don't want to use Book of Belial here. Did not realize it was an XL floor till just now. Just thought it was a, like, you know, long regular floor. Really should have noticed before now, now that I look at it. But I uh, wasn't, wasn't really thinking. I can't, I'm still steaming about losing that Eternal Heart, but we probably, let's be honest, we're going to lose it against, uh, we're probably going to lose the whole run against Eternal 
it lives here, but we would have lost that eternal heart for sure. Probably going to lose the whole run. I just don't feel confident in our amount of damage here. And getting a speed up, you know, doesn't help. No HP anywhere. Yeah, I think we just go. And probably die here. Oh, keep moving. Keep moving. What? I was moving that whole time. How did you hit me? What? No, seriously, though. I guess I shouldn't just dodge in a circle. Circle dodge. I always thought it was the key to Isaac and every other game ever. Circle strafing. Apparently it's not. Alright, maybe I leave you alive. Because you're not that hard. And we just focus on it lives here. I don't want to kill you. Don't make me kill you. I don't want to accidentally kill you even. Huh? <laughs> right into the bullet. Right into the bullet. Oh! Alright, let's go back. Let's perhaps... Man, any other character is going to be harder. Judas and Isaac are our easiest bets. I'm going to go with Isaac again. I'm mostly, honestly, going with Isaac because I can choose what items I get. And those items in the last run sucked. <laughs> so now I can choose, like, ten bombs? I think I'll take ten bombs. I'm happy to be able to just take ten bombs. But if it was freaking sack of pennies, I would have rerolled it. 10 bombs is a borderline reroll, though, to be honest. I, I thought you had that one. Yeah, I kind of had... I thought I had it going with the, uh, the leaving the easy enemy alive there. I thought it was a good strat, but, uh... Just slid into that bullet, man. I thought I had it. I, I didn't... Well, that's not true. You, you give me too much credit. I never thought I had it. <laughs> I, 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 I said several times the way in, like, we're, we're probably gonna die right here. <laughs> I was being honest. I wasn't like, you know, downplaying my skill. I was like, I'm gonna die. And now I'm exhibiting that skill by getting hit by these spiders several times here. This is regular seller one though, so it does not matter as far as... All we gotta do is stay alive. It doesn't matter as far as a deal with the devil goes. Whether or not we take some red heart damage is irrelevant to that. Because you can't get one no matter what, unless uh, unless I happen to land a uh, Joker card for myself. Come on, dog. Work with me here. Quit making so many damn spiders. I hate spiders. They move so erratically. You know what? Fuck you. <laughs> All right, half a heart back. I want to go home and cry. Now, I want to go over here first to see if I can get any HP. I can't. Well, might as well go in the shop, I guess. Get some free money from uh, some fires or something. Mom's purse. We had you last run. I could maybe get into the cursor room this way. Wait, what the heck? Can the curse or the secret room even be here? I didn't think so. Where the heck is it? Secret rooms on first floors are so weird sometimes. Yeah, that's weird. What are you doing up here, secret room? What are you doing? I'm happy to have the key though. A little bit of money. Mm, I think our second secret room almost has to be here. And there it is. This is gonna... I maybe should have waited. I'm gonna go fight first just so to make sure I don't lose that. Maybe should have waited. Because now I'm gonna have to waste another bomb because it doesn't stay open. Like it doesn't rebirth. Again, I'm not saying that's not okay. It's a design choice you can make. I'm not saying I wish this game was Rebirth, it's just in this case I wish that secret room stayed open so I could get that eternal heart. 
But a lot of times when you're playing a game, you wish for something that would be bad design in the game, you know? Like, I wish I would get Polyphemus every run, but if I actually got Polyphemus every run, I'd be like, this game is so boring. You get one item, you win every single time. So stupid. Who would play this? It's no challenge. So you gotta, you gotta respect the design choices, I think. Which ones look a lot creepier when they're uh, eternal? Is it the uh, the big spiders? Is that what you're talking about, Leo? I missed that when you when you typed it. Don't go down there. All right. So first we go in the curse room. Man, wish I could take two spacebar items. Hiya! All right, we actually got an item. The way I hemorrhage health, I think maybe I will actually just. How should I do this? Should I get rid of two red hearts, one red heart, all the red hearts? Turns it into two now. They nerfed it in this. I'm going going ham. Let's do it. All right. We will get one red HP back here, though. Nice. And eight ball. Tears up and... Emperor card's pretty nice. I like that. Didn't really like getting in the Magic 8 Ball in the first place, but uh, I was more inclined to reroll uh, Booga Balao in the Curse Room because it's a better pool there. Alright, regular champion, not an eternal champion. You're still tanky and annoying, but you don't do anything crazy. Crazy! You're, you're a, like down to earth guy. I get you, pink champion. I like that crazy freaking eternal champion. I don't invite him over anymore. Mm. Oh! Nope. Don't do that. Never that. Oh, never that. Oh, goodness. Okay. Find a happy place. Find a happy place! Okay. It didn't shoot. It didn't shoot. I got so lucky there. Alright. Focus. Man, they shoot so much and so fast, all these eternal enemies. Fuck off forever. Daddy long legs. I think I just take that. Yes. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. It's better in rebirth, which is why I hesitated, but it's pretty good. I don't... Wait, I... no, I can do that. I can do this. Yeah, because this will give me a reroll at the end of this room if it is an item. It's not an item. Crap. Crap! Oh! <laughs> Get away from me! Daddy, you're supposed to kill the big one. The big bully. Defend me from the bully. Okay. It's nice. He's going to help out. Maybe a little late that time, but... The thought that counts. Just being a little lazy, letting Daddy Long Legs kind of take care of that one. It's going to be a great passive. I wish there was some way to get him to focus on the, um, the Eternal Champions. But, you know, happy to have it regardless. Uh, let's head boss direction first here. Oh, jeez. On fire ones and the eternal one. Oh goodness. Yep. Yep. It's all that happening. Not much I can do about it. Okay. Hemorrhaging some damage. It happens, man. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Settle down. Cool your jets. Bomb for a couple keys. I like that. Let's check here for our secret room. Nice. Bomb our way into the shop, or let's see what we get out of this if we bomb this first. Alright, well, I'm not bombing my way into the shop. I got six keys. I could key my way into the shop if I need to. Sacrifice room. Let's go fight the boss. Not really prioritizing my rerolls correctly. Thank 
Thank you, Daddy, for helping out. Missing page. Not great. And regular Larry Jr. fight. Larry Jr. is a breeze for Daddy Long Legs whenever he does actually strike. Okay. I'm fine. Don't worry about it. I always make that noise. Jesus juice. Mm, can't help but notice I haven't gotten a deal with the devil. I believe there's been an error. I would like this corrected. I would like to see a deal with the devil in my account by tomorrow morning. <sighs> okay, I don't like that. When that thing gets down into its second stage, it shoots shots so fast. If you could uh, just go ahead and kill it, Daddy Long Legs, I'd appreciate that. Not that one. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there's only one enemy left. There you go. Alright, well, I think you hit it. It's okay, I got it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Alright, nothing in the poops. Nothing in the poops. And I've done everything else on this floor. Maybe we'll get lucky and find a second secret room. Nope. Here we go. Can't get that. Alright. This this uh, run's going okay. We need HP. I really wish I'd gotten a deal with the devil, but I can't won't stay salty about it forever. Just till tomorrow. Key is nice. That room went pretty well. Boss first or let's look I think item room is maybe gonna be closer. I wonder if this still works. I only have one bomb, but I'm gonna try it. You should be able to put a bomb here. Leave. When you come back, the bomb explosion will be bigger and you'll get all those bombs. No! He fixed it! Florian, you asshole! That was one bomb for three and I can't do it anymore. What a jerk. No one likes you. Guardian Angel's pretty good. Does that mean we take Guardian Angel? I think so. It's pretty good. I'll take it. I don't think it merits a reroll. Still salty about that whole bomb thing. Six keys. Key back in four cents. Not not so bad. Six keys again. We'll go in here. Probably can't get charges for our D6 here. I think honestly this might be better to reroll. Yeah. Oh. That freaking pedestal rerolling into nothing bullshit again. <sighs> I don't know. I don't, the meta is so hard to understand when you can reroll into nothing. Like maybe two pedestal items isn't as good there, and I should stick to the ones that have better pools because it's harder for me to exhaust the pool because some of them can reroll into nothing and then it becomes useless. I don't know. It's a lot of gymnastics. I'll let somebody else do the math. Holy shit! Did you see that explode? Look at the size of this! <laughs> Look at this bullshit! There's a little quadrant safety up here. A little quadrant. I did not think I was even close to being able to take damage. I was literally like right here, like right on the cusp. What a what a jerk thing to do to me! All right, focus, focus, focus. Oh, okay. You took out the eternal. I love you. All is forgiven. What we got? We got regular um, fistula here. I can't believe Daddy Longlegs did like no damage to you. There we go. That's more what I'm looking for. Okay, just don't stomp one when it's right next to me, if you would. But stomp one though. Okay. I know I have very specific demands. Don't stomp one when it's next to me, but stomp it now. Dog food. All right. Well, got maybe one room left here. Again, this run not exactly that explosion did seem unfair. Sacred Leo, I agree. Secret room placements are a lot trickier. It's funny. Yeah, they I, they they do seem a lot trickier here than on Rebirth. I think I was misreading your comment. I thought you were saying they were a lot trickier on Rebirth. 
I don't want either of those. I came in there in case there was a uh, half price shop item. Did I check for a secret room anywhere yet? I don't think so. There's two options. There's two options. Let's check here. I knew it wasn't going to be there. Uh, I didn't know. I'm just saying that. How did I not get to deal with the devil yet? I've had soul heart buffers like this whole time, right? I think. Don't know how I have not landed to deal with the devil yet. Oh, this could be dangerous. Chain reaction. Okay, we're good. I'll go in here again just in case there's a half price item. And instead I'll just buy the soul heart. Yeah, that's not... That was a tears up last time, that blue and white pill, but it doesn't have to be now. Oh, daddy. You're supposed to shoot the big guy. Hit the big guy. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. You're going to burst into a bajillion spiders as soon as he stomps on you. If he ever hits you. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, they're only one-shot spiders, which is nice. Oh, can't believe I didn't get in this room. I'm going to be honest with you. I was expecting no less than two damage on that room. <laughs> <laughs> that is surprising for sure again not really finding a good path to prioritize rerolls here just hoping to find an item room have something to reroll have a half price item in the shop that we could reroll oh. <laughs> regular bomb turned into a troll bomb very clever oh I got confused I got confused I hate these guys. I hate these chub shooters, man. I don't know why they seem so much harder in vanilla. I deal with these kind It's the different room layout, I think, is what it is. Because this is not a room layout that maybe even exists in Rebirth. Joker card is extremely useful. I'd rather take the Emperor card with me, I think. So I'm just going to use this now. You rerolled... I don't even want to talk about that shit. I rerolled scapular into scapular. That's not a reroll game. You shouldn't be able. It shouldn't even be allowed. Reroll the item into the same damn item. That that should have had the troll lol lol lol, lol caption, not the troll bomb. Oh, it's making me so salty. Is that better than nothing? Oh ah! Oh, it is better than nothing. Absolutely. But you could have rerolled. Could have rerolled it into nothing. That's good perspective to have. I I guess. Oh god. You're gonna die. I yeah I, yeah I am gonna die. It's also a good perspective to have. <laughs> Thank you for providing for grounding me so well. Ugh. I like that. I like re-rolling that better. What was in the shop? The ladder. So we grab the quarter. I'll buy the uh I won't buy the ladder yet, in case we can get a second re-roll, but I am gonna re-roll the Ankh or Celtic Croc. Uh, or not. Or the whole run. I'm gonna re-roll the whole run. How that's what I was about to finish saying there.